Hello, Jess Too Good here. Today we're taking a look at the Lego Movie 2019 Sweet Mayhem Pod, which retails for $9 in the United States, where you could maybe get it from Lego stores. This one's a little bit harder to find. And it does have one mini doll and 28 pieces. So here's Sweet Mayhem, and usually I'd give like a spoiler warning for her without her helmet, but I guess Lego doesn't care at this point because the packaging in the front shows her without her helmet and everything. And we even have a new set that just got revealed, which shows her clearly. So I guess it's not a spoiler anymore, but the design of the face is actually a really hard to find one. It came in Emmett's Dreamhouse, and I think that's the only other set that it came in. So that's really interesting. Other than that, everything else comes in all the variants of Sweet Mayhem. Unfortunately, there's no helmet in this set. There's no wing attachment. So you're missing a lot of the minifigure, and it kind of seems like Lego just cheaped out there. I still love this hair piece and the shine it has and how it can be used on Lego minifigures, but that is it for Sweet Mayhem. Now for the pod design, the exterior has a lenticular front, which shows Sweet Mayhem with her helmet and wings on, which none of that is included in this set. And on the back, not much, but uh, if you open it up to the right, you have space for her, which behind her has a little bit of a disco design with a blurry look to it, which is kind of confusing. But that seems to be a disco floor because what you're supposed to do is take this part right here, this heart, and you can make your kind of fly around on the disco pad. I don't know, this is how they show it at the back. Yeah, exciting play features there, boys. Other than that, if you want to remove the heart and put her at the stand, they give you enough space there. Also, they have these two little speaker builds as well as that newer heart piece, which I really appreciate that because that's a great piece to get. And it's a Lego lifestyle set, so the instructions are very, very cheaply made, but what do you expect? So overall, Sweet Mayhem's Disco Pod is another pod where kids will like collecting these to get their favorite characters on the lenticular design. But other than that, this really has little going for it. The build's very basic, even though there are some nice pieces like the heart and, of course, the Sweet Mayhem figure. And even the Sweet Mayhem figure just doesn't feel complete without her helmet and the wings and everything. It feels like they cheaped out there. Could have been a space reason too, but for $9, there's so much better sets in this line that have more content to them. So it's hard to recommend this one. Honestly, I'd have to rate this one like a C. And I'm being generous there. But that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Bye.